Hello, in this video I want to show you a print of the IG-11 uh, character that is going to be on the upcoming Mandalorian Star Wars series. It's a character, uh, like a bounty hunter character, but let's have a look uh, after the through. So you probably know a little bit about Star Wars. Uh, they are making a new TV series of, of the Mandalorian. Um, I'm hopefully saying that right. <laughs> I'm not sure how to pronounce it. But uh, in that series, there's a bounty hunter robot called IG-11. Um, I have this model from Gumbody.com. Um, I was uh, really excited to get this model and print it out on my Elico Mars uh, resin printer. I recently got that printer and want to do a, a proper model with all the details possible with the resin printing. Um, it was one of the first uh, real models I used with a printer. So I, I did a little little bit of learning on the fly, so to speak, when I was printing and, and assembling the print. But let's have a look at the, at the guy. So here it is. It's uh, painted in black with uh, like a gold weathering effect. Uh, some pictures from the trailers uh, indicate there's some gold or metallic uh, underlying color in the, in the model, but mostly it's in black. So the weathering is, is somewhat is what I was trying to emulate from the uh, samples photos I got online. Um, I really haven't seen the shows because they're not out yet, <laughs> but they're out now on, on the 12th of November. Uh, it's a fun uh, date because that's my birthday. <laughs> so when you're watching, watching this video, it's, it's my birthday and I'm a big Star Wars fan and having a series coming out on my birthday, it's a really cool <laughs> cool day for me. And here's the model, it's extremely detailed. Um, you might notice if you compare this model, uh, I printed out with a model on Gumbody. Uh, I mixed up the rotation of the legs. Those things here should be on the outside. And when gluing together with super glue, I put one in. I found out as soon as I touched the, the parts with the super glue, uh, they are stuck. <laughs> so there's no time to to adjust anything. Uh, so those uh, are turned out <laughs> in not the proper way, but I don't think it really matters. But it came out excellent. But turning, uh, uh, putting the parts together with super glue is it's quite difficult because sometimes those parts were like on a slide in, like the head should be a little bit lower. And I was just putting it on, and the super glue just hardened right away. Um, I was not using an accelerator, just super glue. So the head is a little bit uh, above its uh, correct position. <laughs> but uh, if you don't know about the, the issues, uh, it's uh, looking quite okay, I think. But it's something that I was just learning with super glue and, and resin prints, but the, the finish of the, of the parts is excellent. The Elico Mars did an excellent job, and there's no sanding of any sorts of, on, on the parts, just the paint job. So I was getting excellent results with the Elico Mars. Um, this model from Cambodia is really detailed. You can see all the intricate stuff on the model. All those tiny like wires or hoses <laughs> come down and each one of those are individually printed out and glued in place. Uh, really, really tiny parts. You can see here compared to my finger. It's really, really high detail. And the detail in the gun uh, is uh, extremely good. So printing with a resin printer for those models uh, I've been doing on Gumbody is definitely something I'm going to continue. It's uh, a breakthrough for me <laughs> uh, to be able to do this model uh, without any sanding, so to speak, just minor uh, fixes uh, that I was taking some supports away. Um, but uh, I think the model came out really good. So this is a, this is a model in full size. <laughs> it's uh, pretty cool and you can see here behind me all the Star Wars characters I've done. It's quite a, quite a number of models <laughs> and if you want to try out this model uh, there will be a link in the video description uh, to it. Uh, it's a link to Gumbody's website and um, it's really a cool, cool model. But this will be it for this video. I thank you for watching and if you like what I'm doing here on the channel please subscribe and ring the bell and leave a comment and let me know what you think. 
Um, since it's my birthday, <laughs> give me a bir happy birthday comment. <laughs> I would appreciate that. But uh, this will be it for now. Uh, I thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next.